Now to this emotional reaction tonight after a Santa Monica jury sided with a Southern California woman in her civil case against Bill Cosby. A jurors found that Cosby sexually assaulted her when she was a teenager. Kick it on you, Jake Reiner is live in Santa Monica right now where that verdict came in earlier today. Jake. Jeff and Jasmine, despite the jury's verdict finding that Bill Cosby sexually abused this 16 year old girl back in 1975 at the Playboy Mansion, both sides are claiming victory. It's been torture. It has just to be ripped apart, you know, thrown under the bus, backed over. It's been a long, harrowing road. Okay. <laughs> But as Judy Huth's attorneys held up her hands like a victorious boxer, the justice she's been fighting for for 47 years finally a reality in the form of a civil trial verdict in Santa Monica. I was elated. Seriously, it's been so many years, so many tears, just a long time coming. Huth is 64 years old now. A jury found when she was 16, Bill Cosby sexually abused her at the Playboy Mansion in 1975. Huff, who came forward with her accusations in 2014, was able to have her day in court due to a fairly new California law, the Child Victims Act, extending the statute of limitations for child sexual abuse victims. That's a strong message to sexual predators. Be careful. Don't underestimate your victim. She or he may come after you, even years later. The jury also awarded Huff $500,000. She would not be getting a dime. Cosby, who was not required to attend the trial, was absent. But his publicist, Andrew Wyatt, was there. And despite the verdict, he too is claiming victory. But what happened today wasn't a victory. They didn't get the punitive damages. The victory was ours because we got to disclose and show what this woman was all about. There was no win here. This decision comes nearly a year after the 84-year-old Cosby's Pennsylvania criminal conviction for sexual assault was thrown out and he was freed from prison. Huff's lawsuit was one of the last remaining legal claims against Cosby after his insurer settled many others against his will. Judy Huff, she's our hero. Huff was supported by other Cosby accusers, each of whom have their own story to tell. Bill Cosby, though his conviction was overturned, you cannot change the fact that a jury of his peers, after listening to all the evidence, all the witnesses found him guilty of sexual assault. Cosby's team maintains his innocence and plans to appeal. Huth's attorney, Gloria Allred, is confident the verdict Tuesday will hold. He may appeal. Good luck to him, because we'll be there to fight the fight for Judy Huth. So the jury did come to multiple conclusions on their jury verdict form on Friday, but the judge had to excuse the jury four person for personal reasons. So they added an alternate juror and then on Monday basically had to start from scratch. That's why we got the verdict today. Reporting live in Santa Monica, I'm Jake Reiner, KCAL 9 News. LA County District Attorney George